All right, what we're going to test today is a 1963 to 1967 Corvette windshield wiper motor. Uh, it's a pretty basic test. First thing you want to do is hook up a ground to the uh, case. And once you get your ground hooked up, then you want to put positive to the center terminal on the, uh, we call it the 123 connector, but it'd be the center terminal. Show them the center terminal. That's that one right there. We painted them white so they'd show up better. Okay, so you run 12 volts to that terminal. Now what you want to do next is you've got the case grounded, you've got the uh, 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 12 volts to the center terminal. We want to ground out uh, the outermost terminal and when you ground that terminal out you should get high speed. And if you look we've got high speed on the motor right there. Now with that ground wire intact, ground out the other side which is the inner one and you pick up low speed and there's your low speed. Now if you remove either one of the grounds the motor should park and there you go. That's how you test a 63-7 windshield wiper motor.